And then the Vikings are sitting at the top of their division with a 7-1 and one record now. But fans are definitely not talking about that. Today, they're all buzzing about Kirk <laughs> Cousins and the uh, mid-flight party that <laughs> seems to be happening on these flights home, Jimmy. Every single flight, it's happening now. And, uh, it's like, what's next? How can they do it, better than what they did yesterday? That's going to be very interesting because if they beat <laughs> Buffalo, it may not be something that could be recorded. They may not share the video of that trip home. It's amazing the transformation of Kirk Cousins from week one where he appeared in a button-down plaid shirt to last night where Cousins, encouraged by his teammates, was shirtless with a ton of ice around his neck. Last night, Kirk and his teammates took it to a whole new level celebrating their sixth straight win. Now, some wonder if the players maybe are laughing at Kirk instead of laughing with him. But... That is nowhere near the case, according to head coach Kevin O'Connell, who says the respect level for Cousins and his level of play has never been higher. I think it's, uh, you know, those moments you can kind of uh, let loose a little bit and, and just enjoy time with your teammates. I, I, I definitely enjoy seeing Kirk join himself like that because the special part about it is the, his teammates know what he pours into it each and every week what he's going to pour into it this week and when he leads us to a win like that certainly is allowed to enjoy it. I don't know if I felt this close to a team here before you know it, it brings everybody together like you see guys coming from the sidelines just to join a celebration um and you know I feel like <laughs> the fans and the media loves it so you know we embrace it we're gonna have something new every week there you go. They're already scheming ahead. But he's a rookie, and he said that I've never felt so yeah. part of a That's team wonderful. this Amazing. quickly. And so, you know, some people say it's going a little too far, but there, there's no. method to the madness yeah. here. You know, it brings everybody together after big wins, and uh, they got a huge test next up yeah. with Buffalo. But Josh Allen was injured yesterday. He has an elbow injury. Don't know yet if he will play or not. He's listed as questionable right now. But if he does not play, the quarterback would be Case Keenum. Yeah. So it would be Case Keenum and Stefan Diggs yep. going against the Vikings next week. Got an make interesting storyline. I'd like to know the monetary value of all that bling, too. I know. Kurt says he may have to break down and actually buy something. Else. That's <laughs> yeah. going to be the next level. I bet they'll buy him something if he keeps winning. Exactly. All right. Thanks, Jimmy. Thanks, Jim.